Dear viewers, today I am going to tell you about the preventive measures of the disease COVID-19. As we all know that COVID-19 is an infectious disease which spreads from person to person through the infected droplets. Uh, when in fact it reaches the healthy people through the mouth, eyes or through the nose, definitely the people stand the chance of contracting the disease. So today I am in short, I am going to tell you the preventive measures which we need to compulsorily follow to avoid the disease. Firstly my dear friends, we do not know in how many ways we might have interacted with the people, in how many different environments we might have uh, you know, had a visit. So, we, it becomes necessary for us to see that we wash our hands uh, uh, often. In fact, the hand should be washed in such a way that no part of the hand should be you know, left behind between the fingers, uh, in the palm and also between the, what I can say, uh, inside the nails we need to wash. The soap, in fact, already we know it uh, kills the virus by you know damaging the lipid membrane of the virus. Secondly, my dear friends, having physical or they can say and social contact uh, with the people should be completely avoided. Why? Because you know when we have social contact with people in crowded places, public places, or in the markets, definitely we stand a chance of getting this disease. And secondly. Why physical distancing is important? One individual, you know, when he is very far away from the other individual, uh, this, is, this also you know, helps us to uh, prevent the disease because especially having uh, the physical, uh, avoiding the physical contact with the elders in our home is necessary with our uh, small children below the age of 3 or 4 is uh, very much recommended. They stand uh, very, you know, very high risk of uh, contacting the disease. So please uh, have physical distance uh, uh, between you and the elders as well as the children. Thirdly, my dear friends, try to avoid the contact with the sick people because, you know, the respiratory droplets may enter uh, our own healthy system and uh, definitely affect us. Please, uh, my dear friends, stay home if you are sick. If you have the symptoms of the disease, please contact your nearest healthcare provider and uh, get your uh, health checkup immediately done. My dear friends, please wear the face mask if you are sick or who you care for is sick. This is also very much highly recommended. My dear friends, clean and uh, disinfect the surfaces uh, which you have touched regularly because again we do not know in so many ways we might have had uh, interaction with our own environment and also uh, the suspected or infected individuals. When you cough or sneeze, please cover your uh, face with uh, the handkerchief or uh, tissue paper because it uh, avoids the spread of the respiratory droplets around our environment and uh, uh, we get protection. The healthy people get protection. Finally, my dear friends, I want to also tell you that especially when we consider the adults and the people who are suffering from chronic medical conditions such as the cardiovascular diseases or the diabetes or even for that case the lung diseases have more uh, chances uh, to get you know the disease. They are more susceptible to the what I can say disease. So, uh, let me also mention you that apart from what uh, preventive measures I have uh, put across uh, today, uh, for more preventive measures, please contact your uh, healthcare provider and also have touch with websites of World Health Organization and also the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare. Protect your community, protect your uh, environment because we all know that today uh, globally how the, uh, the COVID-19 disease is spreading. Let us pray for all the people who are uh, you know, suffering from this COVID-19 and also pray for the safety of people across the globe. Stay safe, stay protected, stay in a home quarantined. Thank you very much.